What's up, guys, and welcome to New Tarot. Let's see who's going to get this general reading today. Ooh. Capricorn, what is going on? Capricorn, <laughs> thank you so much for being here today. This message can resonate with you if you have Capricorn as a sun, moon, rising, or Venus. The energies might be reversed for you, Cap, so take it how it resonates and leave the rest. I hope you guys are doing very well today. I feel like you guys feel weird or something. I don't know. Let's see what's going on. Cat. Caparoonie. I'm pulling two oracles. Let's see. Capricorn. Thank you, Spirit. You have chaos at the bottom of the deck, okay? So this is all happening because things have to get things have to get like riled up in your life, um, Capricorn. Okay. I feel like a tornado, kind of like how this picture is. Ooh, your intuition is telling you this. It's like an a tornado has to come and like take out everything that was there, and you have to start from scratch. Is kind of what I'm getting. Um, but this is like transformational and, and it's helping you see the things that got to go too. All right. So let's get to the energy. The first card you have is playful here. So there's something that you should be taking lightly. Okay. You have pillar of light. Your vibration is rising. You are the oracle. I feel like um, this could be something like where you're helping people or where you're assisting someone in something. And I feel like you could be kind of taking it too seriously. So what is this playful and pillar of light? Bottom of the deck is a seven of pentacles in reverse. You have the page of cups in reverse, the five of cups in reverse, and the death card in reverse. These are all in reverse. You're not listening to your intuition here. This could be about a Scorpio, but there's something here that um, needs to end that's not ending. I feel like it's the relationship between you and this person. Who you're, who you're trying to help, who you're trying to... It's like the universe doesn't want you to help them. Seven of Pentacles in reverse, Eight of Wands in reverse, and the Star in reverse. And it, honestly, Capricorn, what you don't see coming, this person is going to kind of like... This person is going to kind of like turn their back on you. Like, they're just going to be like, well, I don't need your help anymore. Okay, but the Star in reverse, the Eight of Wands in reverse, Seven of Pentacles in reverse, they're going to just stop communicating with you. Um... I don't, I, I don't feel like you want this to happen or maybe they don't want this to happen. I don't know. It could be with Aquarius, but it's going to happen. That's why the universe is asking you to kind of let this go here. It's kind of what I'm getting. I feel like with the five of cups in reverse, you're not going to feel guilty for doing it. But it's like. Maybe you know that you have to stop helping somebody and you are kind of like not um, doing it because you might feel guilty about something or something like that. But I feel like with the Seven of Pentacles in the verse, you've helped this energy enough and it's just like they're just not getting it. You know what I'm saying? So now you kind of have to allow them to kind of, this could be like a child for you guys. This person could act childish, <laughs> but it's like... Now you got to let them figure it out on their own because I feel like they're causing delays for you now because you're spending all your time and all your energy helping this person and they're not even, they're not um, catching what you're throwing. You know what I'm saying? Okay. The next card you have is groove. All right. So you have been chilling, sitting down about something like you got to get up and move. Warrior woman, have you answered your deepest calling? Well, have you? This is the sort of truth, boo-boo. You know that you're supposed to be doing something. You know that you're supposed to be going in a certain direction, spreading some truth, saying something, and you're sitting on it. What is this warrior woman in Groove? You are the king of pentacles. I'm, I'm going to clarify this. Um... You have the Page of Pentacles, the Judgment, and the Sun in Reverse. Oh, what? 
what, what, what? I feel like there's a lot of things going on all at one time. And it's like, and it's like, you know, you know, you're calling, you know what you are supposed to be doing. But because of all of other this stuff that's happening, it's like hard for you to focus on. Because I'm getting like a headache. I'm getting kind of dizzy. Like, I just feel like there's a lot going on. Um, you're the judgment, the page of pentacles and the sun reverse. I don't feel like you're too happy about the fact that you're going to have to decide on something. Um, with this page of pentacles here, I feel like, I feel like it's an offer that's being made, but, but you, you, I think we had this message before. It's a, it's an offer where it's small. It's not a, it's not a big offer, but I feel like it, it, you can build from this offer with the page of pentacles. The page of pentacles is all about learning. Okay. What you don't see coming is the king of pentacles. Like, like I said, you're going to you're going from the page to the king. So, you know, there's steps into this, but I want to see this page of pentacles. What is this page of pentacles? The world. Yeah, that's gonna help you start a new you have you you I don't want to say have to. You should. Okay. The world, the temperance, and the two of pentacles in reverse. Yeah, I feel like at first it might be a little hard to like get your way in there, but I feel like with the temperance in the world, you're going to realize that you were made for this. You were meant for this. And you were because you have the warrior woman. It's your calling. It's your calling. I don't feel like you you thought it was going to take you this direction. But it's like the analogy I gave in the other. I don't know if the analogy is the right word to say. But in, your, in the last video was this is like you, you know, having to step down from CEO of shoebox.com. You know what I'm saying? And then having to work at a supermarket as a cashier right but then it's like you're you're scanning an item and then the ceo of bootbox.com stops by and it's like oh my gosh aren't you the person that created shoebox i used to love it i actually i actually made something called the boot box and you know i would love some of your input in it and you should come work for me and da -da 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 -da, you know like that's what i feel like is gonna happen but you have to trust that this whatever is being given to you um, you can build off of it and that it's, it's for you. And I feel like, you know, that with this, um, sword here, I feel like, you know, it. okay. All right. So let's keep going. The next card you have is individuality. What is this? I feel like this is like you looking at yourself. Um, like I automatically got you just like looking at what makes you different. Okay. Some, some of you guys could be connected to birds. Um, you have break the chain, ancestral patterns, healing, rewriting the future. You're meant to be different, boo. You're meant to be different. You're meant to stand out. So don't even worry about it because you're meant to rewrite the future. You're breaking ancestral patterns from your family. Um, and, I, and, I, and I feel like this is other people kind of like judging your path, what you're doing, how you're moving. Um, what is this break the chain and ancestral patterns, healing and rewriting the future? Bottom of the deck is the King of Cups in reverse, okay? You have the King of Pentacles, the Four of Pentacles in reverse, and the Eight of Swords in reverse. So it's kind of like, um, it's kind of like you're trying to get out of your head about this opportunity. This is this could be all about money here. Um, you're trying to get out of your head here. Because I feel like you have to let go of a big opportunity with the King of Pentacles and the Four of Pentacles in reverse. Um, because it, it's just two of pentacles, three of, three of cups in reverse and the cup in the cup and the king of cups in reverse, whatever energy you're, you're releasing. I feel like there was a lot of emotional manipulation there. This could really be a person or sign Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Um, a lot of people didn't have the best intentions for you and it was becoming too hard to handle. And I feel like, look at, the, well, look what you got waiting for you. The king of pentacles is showing up again. So I feel like you're, you're you might have to take a dip. But you're going to come back up. Like, that's fine. Um, I feel like you are showing... I feel like by you doing this, like you you going down and then coming up, you're showing people around you, look, you, we can do this. This can be done. It doesn't always have to be what looks good, what's shiny, what's more valuable, right? It's all about knowledge and it's all about the journey. Because however the however you're moving... It's it's not normal for people in your family or your or your or your or your community to be moving the way you're moving. You could be, it could, like, people could be, so oh, you're taking a really a big risk. Like, that's a hasty decision. Like, it could be something like that that they're saying, but it's like you have, with the Eight of Swords in reverse, I feel like you already know that this has to get done. I don't feel like you want to do it, <laughs> right? You're not just like, yeah, let's just go for it. But I feel like you know it has to be done, you know? Um, 
So yeah, let's get some advice for you. All right, 10, 10 on the timer. What is pillar light and playful saying? Both of these came out. You have self-esteem and failure here. Okay, so definitely um, you won't. It's by you letting this go. It's not that you're failing. Okay, it's just an opportunity for you to learn that everything has has a, everything has its course and this has run it. I also feel like you're going to feel a lot more confident once you release this because that's kind of I feel like that's the reason why the universe wants to release this because you feel like this is this is this is as far as you could go. This that this person that this thing that you're trying to help is like is like what you need to is the only thing that will accept you. No. There is more and better waiting for you. Get out there, okay? What is this warrior woman and groove? You have trust here, okay? So, yeah. You have to trust in this calling. You have to trust in the opportunity that I said that is really small, but it's going to grow bigger. Like, you got this. It says, I accept that my inner voice will always guide me correctly. Your intuition is right. Don't doubt yourself, okay? What is break the chain and individuality? I feel like it's going to work out a lot better than you think, Cap. Okay, you have patience and purpose. Some of you guys could start with the letter P, your name, or there's a P in this person's name or this energy. I don't know. <laughs> um, I feel like I feel like you know it's gonna it's not gonna happen overnight. Okay, this shift, and I feel like this has happened because you have a purpose on here. Your you your life is not meant to look like anybody else's around you. So if it looks different, it's because it's meant to. You're meant to go through certain lessons, and you're meant to teach people. Um you know a different way about going about life an easier way the 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 sole purpose way you know i could be talking to somebody who's very um spiritual okay all right caps all that i have for you i hope this helped have a good day or a good night whenever you watch this and stay positive